Okay, guys, protect yourself at all times. Obey my command at all times. If you want to touch love, do it now. Go back to the corner. This fight gets underway, and you hate to call any fighter on this UFC roster a specialist. But on one side, you have a definite striker taking on a true five-tool player. And you see a guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, perhaps a sign of things to come as he lands a kick there. Nice kick landed by this gentleman. Big, powerful punch lands. Now he gets back to range. Oh, nice check on the leg kick offering there. Beautiful body kick. Knows that is certainly a step in the right direction. Mission accomplished. You are battering that news. Oh, slips to avoid the right. Just over three minutes to go. Oh, trying to turn out the lights with that roundhouse kick, but just misses. Hands high, hands high. Nice defense there, huge block. And he connects there with a punch, so pretty good striking display by him thus far. He throws everything so straight and so accurate. Overhand left, right to the dome. Oh, it's a hell of a kick right there. He told us Thursday that he was going to be kick heavy tonight, and that is certainly a step in the right direction. He is landing that strike. He's very effective with it. Nice body kick right on the elbow. Oh, nice punch there by Lee. Oh, caught him flush with the head kick there, DC. Beautiful setup to get his leg up there quickly before his opponent could react. Under two minutes to go in the round. Some fighters don't check a lot of leg kicks. That one was checked. Oh, nice right hand. Oh, and he connects with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton, and to watch his punch like this puts a smile on my face. Right hook to the head blocked. Lands flush with that right hand. Oh, pinpoint jab to the head on the counter for him. And again, he's the longer fighter. It's going to be easier for him to counter than his opponent. Lee gets caught with that punch. He'd be wise to get those hands up. What a tricky head kick. Tried to set up the straight left, but he missed. Oh. 
big punch lands over the top. How's he gonna follow this one up? Oh, beautiful jab there. It's one thing to have length. Of course, it's another to use it effectively. Beautiful job with that jab. And he landed the right hand there. Lee gets tagged with that jab. Pretty good weapon for him tonight. Five minutes in the books. All right, now we check out some of the action from that previous round, DC. How about the display of striking? Just high level. I mean, you would think that we're watching a K-1 level kickboxing match opposed to being in the UFC. Both displayed great technical skills, unbelievable striking. All right, here we go with round two. Round one, pretty Ready? good, not great, but some action Ready? on both sides. We can't always hope for fireworks, John. Yeah. Sometimes we got to deal with the ebbs and flows of a fight. In round number one, you saw both guys have success. Let's see who really charges out ahead in the second round. Nice kick. You can really limit the mobility of your opponent with those leg kicks. Timely defense there, huge block for him. Well, the left hook has been there at times, not that time. Big kick. Nice kicks there by Lee. Switching stances here. Blocks the strike. Look at how he turns his hip into that leg kick. Look at him working at trying to shut the liver down. Ooh, head kick lands, he's hurt. Oh, that's a nice strike. Lee gets absolutely punished by that head kick. Just over three minutes to go. Right on the button. All right, so he's landed some good shots. You hate to be overly critical, but nothing really in terms of combinations tonight. Well, the jab has been looking great. How about jab, jab, right hand? Right. Because eventually you're gonna have to put something on your opponent that's gonna really make him pause. I believe the jab has been working so well, if he drops a big right hand after it, he may be able to finish his fight. Checks that leg kick. Well, he's got the longer reach, and he certainly showed it there in landing that straight punch. What a body kick. He is throwing a fast, straight hard jab. That's not a feeler jab. That's one that's really knocking the head back. Ooh, what a punch. And both guys really throwing with authority. So a much different approach for him here in this second round. He was a little bit tentative in round one, a little bit of a feeling out process. Now he has clearly found his rhythm, found the range. We'll see if he can continue with more activity here in round two. What a fantastic strike to throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. All right, well, both fighters pretty comfortable on the ground, DC, but you got to be very careful hanging out here for too long if you're his opponent. Oh, nice job using his strength there to posture up. We'll see what he can do now. He's going to start looking to land big shots from the top. Well, as usual, suffocating work from the top here by Lee. Crazy accuracy and efficiency with these ground and pound strikes here, and if you're the opponent, You've got to intelligently defend or the referee's going to stop. you got to defend, but you can see him now starting to gain posture and the intensity at which he's throwing these ground strikes is starting to improve. It's starting to elevate because he knows that he can get the finish. 
Pretty good work with the ground and pound here by Lee. All right, he's very comfortable fighting off his back, DC. Now looks like he's trying to hip escape. Yeah, he's trying to hip escape or maybe look for a Kimura here. Oh, man, that's a nice kick right there. He's doing a great job of landing that kick over and over. Counters with that inside leg kick. Strike attempt there is blocked. Fifteen seconds remain in the round. Got clip with the right hand. All right, let's take a look back at some of the replays from that last round. Unbelievable to see these high-level competitors get in each other's face, tuck their chin, bite down on the mouth guard, and just let it all hang out over the course of five minutes. All right, so back-to-back -back entertaining rounds. We'll see how it goes in this round. We'll see which corner sort of maximize those 60 seconds on the stage. This is what happens. Very skilled, very even match fighters coming together. Nobody has really taken a lead in this fight. Let's see who does it going into the next round. Well, most fighters can't keep up this type of aggression and pace, but you don't have to worry about this guy. He hasn't really showed any signs of slowing down tonight. Liver kick, if you take those kicks, it's gonna shut your body off. Good punch, Lance. Try to establish that jab. Oh, and he caught the kick. Very tricky when he throws that body kick. As he gets close and he's out of the kicking range, he'll, he'll change his stance. Trying to establish that jab once again. There's no give on that leg kick. That is, oh man, this dude is good. That shot blocked by Lee. All right, throws a straight punch and lands, so that is increasingly becoming an effective weapon for him tonight. This is one of his best strikes, and he's throwing it over and over again. Just over three minutes to go now. Big punch lands through the middle. Oh, he lands another strike to the body, really starting to pile up these body shots here in the latter stages of this fight. You didn't see a lot of that in the earlier rounds, making up for lost time here. Misses again with a right punch. Oh, and he connects there. His hands look good tonight. So fast. I mean, this guy has tremendous hand speed. Blocked by Lee. Powerful leg kick lands. Oh, 
Oh, he's really starting to apply pressure on his opponent here. Different approach here in the last couple rounds, and it's the exact sense of urgency that you want to see from a fighter take the judges out of it. Nice punch lands over the top. Oh, spinning back fist. He didn't telegraph that one at all. He's throwing every part of himself into these big leg kicks. Well, it's one thing to have length. It's another thing to use it, and he does it as well as anyone. Nice kick there by Lee. Oh, nice uppercut there. Planted and fired there. Landed to the body. Well, we wondered earlier why there weren't as many body strikes. He's making up for lost time here. Shot to the body connects, and that bear's watching. That's gonna hurt this opponent. That's a really strong leg kick there by Lee. 20 seconds now remain in the round. 15 seconds to go. Lee gets touched by that leg kick attempt. Blocks that strike. That's three rounds in the can. We're headed to the championship rounds. All right, so an entertaining five minutes. Let's look back at some of the highlights, DC, and I'd imagine a lot of these replays are gonna be rooted in that kicking game that was on full display. Absolutely. You're gonna see a lot of different techniques, but the kicking was the key to him getting ahead in this fight. He's out ahead now. He needs to stay the course and continue to do that as the fight goes on. All right, we'll see how it goes here in this next round. A high number of kicks landed there in the previous round, and at some point, these are going to really start to take their turn. They do start to take an effect whenever you're taking kick after kick after kick. And watching him fight with that knowledge and that patience shows his fight IQ. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. He has a commitment to kicking tonight, and it shows. Again, going back to the jab just out of range. Effective strike there by Lee. Oh, and there's that head kick. He kept talking about the opening that would be there on Thursday. Those words proven prophetic right there. I mean, his vision and his timing allows him to get that technique off. Big kick lands. Oh, massive head kick there. We'll see if he can finish. Real sneaky head kick gets in there. Well, he has landed some good shots, DC, but really unable to string anything together in terms of solid combinations. It's because he's not committing to it fully. He throws his jab. He may blow the right hand out there, but he's not really sitting down on the right hand. He really doesn't seem to have the intent on landing it. He's got to be confident that it's going to land, and he's got to really throw his whole entire body into those strikes. Look at the whip action that comes from him throwing that kick. Lee's punch to the body is blocked, so no damage done there. Great punch. Look at him drive his shin into his opponent's body with that body kick. Under three minutes now to go in the round. Sneaky head kick. He's going after the head. Oh, hook shot blocked there by Lee. Oh, good head movement there. Nice slip. Well, that left hand has been there at times, not on that attempt.
flips. Leg kick checked nicely by Lee. I mean, he's cutting them down to size with these beautiful leg kicks. Over and over, he's landing these big body kicks. Ooh, what a punch. Back and forth we go. Big body kick land. So there it is, longer reach, paying dividends as he counters with a punch. Oh, nice job to slip off the center line there. His head movement has been a huge, huge factor defensively in this fight. You can never be a stationary target, so even if the feet aren't moving, you gotta be ready to slip that head at a moment's notice. Final minute. Five seconds remain in the round. Hands high, hands high. That one snuck in. Nice strike. All right, so a nice straight punch there after he caught the leg. He decides to punch out as opposed to going for any takedown. Big kick lands. Lee going with the kick to the body, but unable to find the range. Oh, Superman punch. Just out of range with that right hook. Twenty minutes down, potentially five to go. All right, so the kicks to the body, certainly the big storyline in that previous round. DC, take us through the replay. He did a fantastic job of finding his spots. He was sneaking that kick right up under the elbow and landing those nasty body kicks. He did a great job of recognizing a weakness in his opponent's game and really taking advantage of it. It's just a little blood. We've been here before. You've been cut. No worries. We like the taste of our own blood. Now's the chance to go out. Ready? So here it is, folks. Fifth and final round. Oh, nice connection there with a the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Nice job moving off the center line. He slips to avoid that right hand. Oh, big hit. Big hit. Oh, oh, fight thus far. How's his opponent still standing? I mean, I have no idea. This fight is supposed to be over. And it might not be over now, but it's going to be over very soon. Big kick land. and it's blocked. Beautiful body kick. Just out of range with that left hook. And he connects with a punch there. We'll see if there's more where that came from. Boxing, boxing, boxing. Chopping the wood. Chop the wood with those leg kicks. Hands higher. Hands higher. Just over three minutes now to go in the fight. Liver kick. Oh, flush knee to the body. He's got the length advantage in this fight and certainly made it count in that exchange. Under three minutes now to go round five.
Well, he put so much stock into this fight, and now we're late in the game, and if he doesn't get a finish, this opportunity goes by the board. I mean, it's almost over. Right now, he's got to start throwing everything he can find at his opponent and hope that he can force a mistake and overwhelm his opponent to try to get a finish. Two minutes now to go in the fight. Strong defense there to block the shot. Gets hit with a kick here. Let's see how he is. He lands and maybe time to get the bonus checks ready. I mean, this fight is about done. He's got him hurt very bad with his head kick. Now he has to find one more strike to end the night. Lee's his strike attempt there is blocked. Big head kick lands. Man, look at that damage on the right side of his body. Starting to really bruise now. Throwing that jab yet again out of range. 45 seconds remain in the round. Oh, what a top. This fight's gonna be over, DC. What a great way of mixing up his attack. He didn't stay the course. He mixed it up. He went high when his opponent thought he was going low, and now he's got him hurt very badly. Nice jab by him there. He's going nose hunting tonight, huh? Yeah, he's great with the jab. And not only as a setup, he really is trying to get damage off every time he throws this punch. That jab is fast. Look at that jab. That's a big strike right there. The final horn sounds. All right, so the fight goes the distance. We'll take a look back at the action, but should go his way given all he got done in the striking game. Yeah, he did a great job of landing at will, mixing up the target, doing everything that he's become known for in order to cruise to a very good decision. I know he didn't get the finish that he wanted so bad coming in here tonight, but he had a phenomenal performance, and he showed that he's one of the best fighters in the world. All right, it looks like the official decision is in. Yes, here's Bruce Buff. Ladies and gentlemen, after five rounds, we go to the judges' scorecards for a decision. All three judges score the contest. 49-46. Played the winner by unanimous decision, Bruce the Dragon!